What's good you guys? It's your boy Chai Dizzy coming back to you with another video. So I'm currently about to head to work, but there was one little feature that I found out about the Jeep Wrangler. Now, if you just so happen to have the JL like I do, um, these dome lights can get a little bit annoying when you're exiting the car and it just shines so bright in here, letting everyone know who's in the vehicle. But me, I like to stay low key um so i typically just have this off so one feature that i've been trying to figure out for quite some time now is how to turn these off or turn them on when i need them so it's like you typically in other cars you click the middle and then boom the whole car lights just goes the lights turns on but you know obviously you gotta go each individual but that I just wanted to just figure out how to turn it off at the dealership. They didn't explain it to me because I didn't ask. So I went and figured out that here, I don't know if you can see it, this right here turns on the dome light. So when you when you scroll it all the way up, dome light is on. When you scroll it all the way down, dome light is off. But when you're midway, and you open the door, dome light comes on. When you put it all the way down and there's like a final click, there it is. No dome light. Door open, no dome light. Door open, no dome light. All right, you guys. So hopefully this kind of gives you a better visual. If you can see where my finger is, so I'm about to turn the lights on. All right, you see where my finger is? This is the switch that I was telling you about right here. Now, I have it all the way switched up. So that's why the, the dome light is on. Now, when I turn the dome light down and it starts to get dimmer, now I'm at the very bottom switch where when I open the door, the dome light doesn't come on, right? But look how faint that is. That's like to a regular eye. So how you're seeing it is how I'm seeing it. That is as close as I can get you. And I kid you not, at night, yes, it's visible, but I wish they had it like about here. If they could keep that light, the, the, the interior light to this level where I don't have to turn the dome light like I still have the option to turn the dome light on or off separately would be amazing. But I have to keep it extremely low just to keep that dome light off. And I'm, I'm always messing with this because I can't really see. I, I want it more lit, you know, dealing with any headlights at night and having this on extremely low does not is not beneficial to to anyone. So something I wanted to bring to light, but this is just one of those things. So that's a little, a uh, little trick that I figured out. I don't know if you guys have been looking for it, but I, I would say this is probably the only video out on YouTube about the dome light. So if you have any other questions or anything else that you wanted to know or see that no other YouTuber are doing, uh, let me know, and I'll go ahead and put that video out for you guys and give you more information. Don't ask me why my button is so up to my neck. This is how I feel with this freaking shirt because it's just it's just too wide. Anyway, that's besides the point. Um, that's it for the video, you guys. Like, share, subscribe. Again, your boy Char Dizzy with another video. I'll catch you guys at the next one. Peace.